hope you guys can hear me okay. I apologize if there's hammering and stuff going on in the background. People are doing construction next door. So um, I had some more input from the universe about my situation here. So I wanted to issue an apology for somebody who might not even know that I owe them one, but supposedly one situation was not at all what I thought it was and might not have been narcissistic harm after all, but it might have been my own paranoia over a lifetime of dealing with some really, really toxic people. So um, I just want to say that uh, even though I haven't embodied this myself, the, the principle of um, <clears throat> responding rather than reacting, <clears throat> it's sometimes appropriate because you don't always know if you're right when you don't know all the facts in a situation. Um, sometimes you might kind of have to lose your ego a little bit like a bruise your ego a little bit, bruise your own ego a little bit to realize that um, the way that you saw a situation can flip on its head in a millisecond. And I figured out that there were two or three different very, very plausible ways that this one situation could have worked out. And I'll give more details later, but I just wanted to say that on behalf of the universe, I owe somebody an apology. So um, I'll keep it there and then later on we can have a discussion about narcissism because one of the things that happens when you've been narcissistically abused a lot is that you pick up what's called fleas. And fleas are little things that bite you, you know? And when a narcissist abuses you, the fleas jump off of them, and you hear the you hear the um, invasive toads and frogs croaking. So, yeah. So anyway, sometimes when you get narcissistically abused, you pick up the traits of your abuser, and um, I've certainly done a lot of that. I'll admit that you know, as a certified codependent. I definitely had the tendency to pick that kind of thing up and it, it made me do a lot of evil things in my life, you know, and, um, <laughs> I'd rather not admit them on camera, but, um, let's just say that, oops, I did it again. <laughs> All right. Love y'all. And, uh, more videos to come later. Maybe if I can get my act together. And uh, who knows what kind of crap 